What's going on, everybody? Blazing here. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Uh, so Sunday, we pulled the 10 winners for the um, monthly gem packs, right? Last rotation of Centranos. We uh, failed to basically clear Centranos on Steven's account, right? Uh, we learned early on that that wasn't going to happen because of the champion development. And on the main account, we failed by one stage, right? So uh, deal is, I failed. I'm going to be giving away five monthly jump packs for each account. Now, uh, Sunday, again, we pulled the winners. So the winners are, now some of them have already been claimed, right? Uh, people were watching the stream. They got on it. Now, uh, for you to claim this, you're going to have to DM me in Discord. In the description below, you will find me, um, my username in Discord. You can also... Um, you know, any content creator's channel, you have Nacho, you have Ken, uh, you have Jay, you have Gessels, you'll find me lurking in their content creator channels. Uh, so you can always, you know, try to find me through that way as well. But, um, we have MMEC4KU, uh, and his comment was, I am level 51, couldn't play Centranos. Too early of an account. So I guess that was a good challenge, right? Um, we have Alpha Bravo Gaming, um, who was actually also one of the winners. Um, we have user RE5RB blah, 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 <laughs> um, uh, who says, good luck, everybody. I don't recall how far I got into uh, Cursed City. I just know regearing was a pain. 100% agree. Um, again, we have another user. Uh, I guess people aren't putting in usernames on uh, YouTube. They're not creating them. So um, I didn't get many stages cleared myself, maybe 50 or so in each difficulty. Mostly was because the lack of silver to keep swapping gear. Plarium, are you listening? Please. Um, we have Ethan Barker, who was also a winner. Hardest part of Centranos for me was not, uh, was having enough silver and Awakened Champions. Awakened Champions has been my biggest complaint. The silver is definitely a hard one. Uh, we have Arthraz 7851, who says, As free to play, it was so difficult. Centrano slash rotation. So many champions for that content. Only was able to do like 20 levels. Um, I, can, I can definitely agree with that. Uh, then we have Althred 6466. My biggest challenge for last rotation um, apart from the stages I didn't complete was like S19, S20, S17. Only had one freeze champ, four fire unite boss, uh, no Cardi L. Then we've got Rhizora Ninja. The hardest part of Centranos was the restrictions for each floor, especially for someone without a well-developed roster. It was difficult. Agree. Definitely uh, can be very difficult if you don't have the champions. Uh, next one was user RM7. Uh, didn't have a lot of stages cleared, maybe 100 between both difficulties. The issue is not having time or silver or the regear. The time, I am definitely feeling that right now. I'm finding time to regear every champion because I don't have enough gear on the account to build everybody, right? I'm still kind of working on that. Next one, we have Annie Elf. 145 biggest challenge was not having the champs built or having the necessary champs at all again um time that we need to build these champions could be easily resolved with a wardrobe feature plarium get on that and that's it that's all of our 10 winners uh congratulations to every single one of those guys congratulations to um you know uh, actually thank you all for <laughs> joining on this giveaway now, um, recently I did put out a poll saying that, you know, I wanted to take some sponsorships up so we can start doing a little more giveaways on the channel, right? Um, I'd like to do, you know, as many as we possibly could. I, the community is great. You guys are great. And I want to, you know, I, I love what you guys do for me, which is give me an outlet to kind of do something I love. And I would want to, you know give back to you guys right and then doing the giveaways is my way of, of doing that along with you know whatever account takeovers i do now um 
as I said, the sponsorships have came in. I have been looking at it. Uh, we're going to do one sponsorship. Um, we're going to do the second week of the month. So I will make an announcement over on YouTube. Um, when we take the sponsorship, I'll give everybody a couple of days in advance. Um, again, a majority of the money uh, coming in from that, right? Uh, we'll be going back into giveaways for the channel, giveaways for you guys. So hopefully the more people we have, the more we can complete of the sponsorship, the more giveaways we can do. Um, it could be, like I said, anywhere from 5, 10, up to 30, um, maybe even more, depending on what the, the sponsor's paying. Uh, and so, you know, everybody is going to get a chance to do this as long as, you know, we can complete or we can get some part of the sponsorship done. So. Uh, be on the lookout for that. And uh, that's it, guys. Uh, make sure to join us again on Sundays for the Knights of Teleria. Uh, you get myself, JR Star 3, Nacho Plays 50, Gesto Gaming, Jared Gaming, along with Final Compache, where we talk everything Raid Shadow Legends. We talk about the good, the bad, the ugly. We'll be talking about the Fortis buff, Larium, this week. Um, but. It's a great fun time, right? Uh, you have get multiple players, multiple perspectives of end game players, early game players, free to play, pay to win, whales, krakens. Um, and so it's a good time. So 2 p.m. EST on Sundays. As always, guys, much love, much appreciation. Be safe, be well, be good to each other. I'll catch you guys next time.